Oh. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> up good people aka winners that's what we do a hey, that's all we do a a a a i'm coming to you with another beat yo a hey, coming to you with another beat yo thicky thicky this is Siki here okay per the huge and i am this is literally like for real we're just gonna talk we're just gonna have some real talk we're just gonna have some girl talk we're just gonna have some family talk because i am getting ready for something tonight and i figured why not just film and get ready because i'm really not trying to sell anything and not that i always am but the thing is um i don't want that to be the uh, focal point today right like what products i'm using of course i will list it in the description box and i will talk about it as i use it but the focal point is us talking today if that is okay you feel me i would ask that you like this video uh, uh comment on this video share this video because that's what keeps the channel alive all right and also it was one more thing oh how could I forget don't forget to subscribe because that is how you get notifications and that is how you do not miss a beat and you want to make sure that you customize your notification so that it so that YouTube doesn't pick what videos they want to notify you of okay I am rocking like a grayish color today and so I want to go with a gray type smoky eye but the thing is when I do a gray type smoky eye I love to use like a more of a neutral brown, not like a cocoa kind of brown because I need it to go along with, um, you know, that, that kind of like cool tone that the gray gives you. So I wanted to talk with you guys and first off, tell you that, um, I love y'all and I miss y'all. And I also wanted to tell you that there's a few reasons why my videos aren't as, um, as like consistent like oh it's gonna drop on this day every day and i remember when i used to do videos like three and four times a week and then i would do videos like every single saturday or every single friday and then now it's a little more sporadic it may go up on a tuesday have other businesses as well and business has really picked up a lot and so i've been doing that as well as you guys i have something very very special that i've been working on and I can't really talk about it yet, but you guys will be, you guys will be one of the first to find out, um, once what happens happens. Cause I can't talk about it right now, but I am going to go in with this Morphe. I I'm thinking this is going to work out. This should work. Cause that's not, Oh baby. That's looking a little more Brown. Sorry y'all. I'm actually using the Morphe 3502 palette and i may have to mix this with the brown that i usually use i don't even know what shade this is because i don't know what i did with that plastic portion but anyway so i wanted to tell you guys that and i also wanted to say that another reason whoa that's dark see i don't plan these looks i just come to y'all and we chat but anyway another reason that i haven't really come on either is because let's face it it's a whole lot going on in the world today right like you know first you got like the whole pandemic situation and then you have all of this like racism stuff and and all this stuff going on and people being killed for no reason and you know what i'm saying and then i know that there was a call to different makeup brands to come forth and and um you know state their stance and all that kind of stuff and so it's kind of like during something so serious and so crucial and so critical and so vital and so important it's like do you really want to do a makeup video you get what i'm saying do you really want to do a review like i'm super sensitive to where we are right now so it was like I really didn't want to do that but at the same time i wanted to and i'm just finding my stuff i wanted to talk to you know to my brothers and sisters my fellow winners out here and i just wanted to see if you guys were okay and just let you guys know that i love you and just let you guys know that you know i'm praying just praying that you guys are out there staying healthy and being safe you know what i mean and just know that like if i could say anything it would be you know don't be led by your emotions because it is a very emotional time like this is some serious stuff that's going on people are doing some evil things like for real but what we don't want to do is <clears throat> respond out of emotion and then because a lot of times you know 
when we respond out of emotion or anger or um, maybe even feelings of hate or whatever, it, the outcome is never good. So I just want to make sure that you guys are out there staying, you know, safe and staying healthy. And when I say healthy, not just healthy physically, but healthy spiritually, healthy mentally, right? So I'm just just checking on y'all. So comment in the um, comment section, like I'm good, like I'm I'm making it, or like I'm not okay, or like you know, or whatever. Like this is a, a time for us to chat. This is like serious, right? So that's why I didn't come on like, oh, I'm doing a review on this and I'm doing a review on that, because honestly. I don't even know what brands are standing with, you know, us during this time. And when I say us, I'm talking about, you know, black lives, right? Because black lives matter. That's super, super serious right now. Not that others don't, but th this needs attention at this moment. You get what I'm saying? Because like, yeah, innocent people are dying and rather innocent or not, you just don't take a life. I don't even know what shade this is. This is probably like a makeup week or something, but um, I was going to put like a base on, but I don't think I am. I'm just, I already have concealer on and I put the, um, Too Faced, uh, Born This Way, multi-use, multi, multi, girl, use concealer. And I'm really not here, like I said, to be like, I love this brand. Like, no, I'm just doing my makeup because I have something to do later. And I just wanted to talk to you guys. So, yeah. You know, you, let's just be like the light right now. Let's just show people love. Let's make sure that we are a representation of love. And I know that, you know, it, it's some angering things or some, some upsetting things happening, but let's make sure that, you know, we are showing love, right? Because hate plus hate just equals more hate. You know what I mean? And so we just want to make sure that we're showing love. We just want to make sure that, you know, we're praying for our family members, praying for our nation, you know, and giving it to God because y'all know I'm a believer so I'm gonna talk about it right um and you know if you're not with it you're not with it if you're not with it you know focus on the makeup if you with it like listen let's just be in agreement what I do want to say too because you guys might be asking oh this is another thing I want to talk about too like I don't even know how long this video is going to be like this is just a straight up I should have done this live so I could really really talk to y'all but um I like as far as all these things opening up, I know that like, you know, we're still we like in Los Angeles here. They have us on curfews, y'all, even though there's curfew and then some places haven't opened and yada, yada, yada. And some places have. I just want to encourage y'all, like, don't be running out there trying to do everything and be in every store. Right. You know, take your time getting out there. And um, let me see. I think I want something a little more neutral than this. But anyway, take your time getting out there. Like, do not rush to go out there. With that being said, that's what I'm saying. Like, these nails, I usually don't do this length, but it's actually okay for me. But these are, um, I got these from Ardell. They sent them to me, uh, Ardell Nail Addict. And so I wanted to try them. And I usually like to use adhesive, but this time, like this brand didn't come with adhesive and I'm, I'm okay with that. I just did the glue and I'm going to rock them because I have something to do today. And I was like, I can't have my little <laughs> stubby fingers cause they wasn't looking too nice <laughs> the way my fingers is looking. So I had to do something. I don't have a problem with this whole quarantine situation and I'm not in a rush to get out there and just do anything. Like I'm actually taking this time to do um, things that like to move forward in visions and, and, and dreams that were given to me before this stuff even happened, right? So I'm taking this time to move forward. I'm taking this time to um, accomplish some things, which you guys will see. So I am excited about it and I'm not mad. I don't know how you guys are doing, but if you guys are um, essential workers, then I definitely pray for your safety, you know, to and from your destination. And if you are, you know, on the front lines, like whether you work at the post office or uh, whether you work at the hospitals or whether you work at the grocery store, or, you know, stores like Target and Walmart and different things that, that, um, have our essential items. I just, you know, pray that you are out there staying safe, that you are making wise decisions, you know, that you are covered, that you are protected. And, um, you know, and I just want to thank you from the bottom of my heart for, you know, doing what you do because you are so needed. Right. And, you know, we got to get food and we got to get all the essentials that we need. And so I'm just grateful for you guys. And I wanted to tell you guys that too. And I'm not bashing any companies. I'm not bashing any people, but my prayer is that, you know, everyone will like love on everyone, right. That there will be that, that, 
there will be equality and that we can just love life, enjoy makeup, right? <laughs> oh, and another thing that I wanted to talk about too was not being in fear, y'all. Don't, I, I know that it's a sensitive time, but I don't want anyone to walk around in fear. Pray over yourself, you know, if you believe in, in blessed oil and all that, anoint yourself. And then, and get out there and do the things that you need to do. Now, don't be out there doing stuff that you ain't got no business doing, but get out there and do the things that you need to do. Don't, don't operate in fear. Don't walk in fear because I do believe that that, 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 you know, I, I don't want to get too deep on it, like too deep spiritually, but I just, you know, don't walk out there in fear, but I'm not saying don't protect yourself. And I'm not saying to be ca not to be cautious, but just don't live your life in fear because fear has torment in it. So we still want to find the things in life that makes us happy. And one of my things is, you know, spending time with my family. The other thing is <laughs> makeup, right? And other things like all things, fashion, all things, beauty. And so I kind of been playing in that, but I do have a, a I do have a confession. Like I literally have not been taking care of my face like I need to. You see, like I had a little situation right there and then one right here. Um, I haven't been doing like my mask and I've really been doing like different as it pertains to washing my face. Like before, you know, when we were just on our regular schedules and stuff, it's like, get up in the morning, do this, get dressed, da, 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 da. Uh, yeah, I slacked off because I might not wash my face until like three or four. I might not wash my face till like noon. You understand what I mean? And my face is like, yo, what the world? What the birthday? What is you doing? I didn't say, what are you doing? I said, what is you doing? Right. And so, um, but just give me some time and I'm going to get back on my regimen. Cause you guys know that I have a whole skincare book, right? So it's like, baby, you can't be representing skincare and you got all this going on, honey. So we getting our life together. Um, I am using some Ardell lashes. This is totally not sponsored by Ardell, but girl, I wouldn't mind if it was, okay? But um, these are, I doubled them up and you have to be careful when you double lashes up because you know, you got to make sure they stay together because sometimes it can look like you did a double up and it's like, you're losing a lash. What's happening? And so I'm going to put those on. I think these are the 213s mixed with the 778s. Oh, and let me tell you what else. Mini Me, she started a, uh, she started a, a not a make, girl, makeup, no. She started a t-shirt line, which is pretty dope. And so I'm super proud of Mini Me. Mini Me has been doing some things too. I know y'all been waiting on like lip swatches, but the way our life is set up, like for real, we have both, ha we both have had a lot of things going on, but great things, great things that you'll see. But she, um, dropped some shirts. Um, I will put in the description box, I will put her, uh, it's called A Money Designs. I'll put the, her link tree and all that stuff that gives you all her stuff. But her shirts are great quality because I'll be wanting to sleep in them jokers. She has one that says millionaire. She has one that says CEO with like the, the millions, you know, the zero, zero, zero. Because she write them checks with a whole lot of zeros <laughs> and some other things. So, you know, listen, my baby is doing things and I'm excited. The thing I wanted to t talk about too, because um, we just talking and we just having family time, like a little family meeting, if you will. Another thing I've been seeing on social media is people have literally been talking about, you know, um, 2020, like pull over and let me out and da, 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 da. And they've been saying little, you know, different things about 2020 and about how it's not being good and stuff like that. But what I want to tell y'all is watch what you speak over your future. Y'all know that I am very, very big on the words that I say, the, the things that come out of my mouth, because I know that our words frame our world, right? We have, we actually can bring things to life. We have the power to create with our words, right? We were created to create. So when you go saying different things like this year has been this and that, and I don't want to let's pass it or let's go back or whatever. I'm not speaking that over my life because this year is not over. And just because, you know, there's different things going on does not mean that, that, the rest of this year is going to be horrible does not mean that it's going to be horrible for me because even in the midst of a pandemic this has literally been like the best months of my life even though we've been um you know in the house and stuff like that like just you know things have been opened up i mean you know i'm able to see certain things clearly i'm able to move forward in some of the things that god has given me to do so use this time 
to find out what your purpose is, to find out if you're supposed to, you know, start a business, to find out if you're supposed to start some online classes, right? To maybe get your house organized, to maybe spend time with your children because maybe you hadn't been able to because, you know, you were so busy for whatever reason. Take this time to take time to do something that maybe you've been wanting to do. During this time, I literally have to be conscious about, um, you know, the hours spending on social media, the people that I'm watching on social media. Like some people I had to literally like, okay, I gotta unfollow you cause you're doing too much, right? Even with your, uh, even with your news intake, just be very careful y'all. Just be careful the things that you are allowing to, you know, to come in. You may be a little bit fearful and then be kind of paranoid and have anxiety and not even knowing where that came from. Well, it could come from the things that you're watching or the things that you're allowing to get in through social media. So just be very careful. And I've been trying to be a little bit more mindful of that. I don't like to use the word trying, but um, it has been my goal to be a little bit more mindful. Yeah, we got to correct all over here because I told you situation. But it has been my endeavor to be mindful of the things that are, you know, that I'm taking in and what I'm putting out, which what I'm putting out is a result of what I'm taking in. Right. I'm not saying that you want to escape reality, but it is good to do something that makes you happy to do something where your mind is at ease and it's not on guard. Right. Or focusing on all the negativity. By no means am I saying try to wash it away and act like it's not there at all. Trust and believe that's not what I'm saying. But you can't be, you know, there every moment, and every hour. All right. So anyway, I am mixing some Urban Decay and I am mixing some Rihanna. And if you guys want to like toss in the comments, maybe some, um, uh, like black owned businesses too, that we can support during this time. That'd be great as well. Cause like I said, I'm not aware of all of them. Cause uh, it's just, you, you can't be in 50,000 places at one time. And I told you I've had a lot going on the last few weeks or even few months, if you will. If you are, you know, um, another YouTuber that is putting some positive content out there, put your stuff in the comments too. Put a little love in your heart. Boom, 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 boom. Emma song. Don't ask me. I don't know why. <laughs> I am using the Juvia's Place Concealer. This is in the number 12 and I am blending that out. I'm actually using this Black Radiance uh, Banana Powder just to set under the eye. Not, I don't bake under the eye, which I have talked about a lot, nor do I bake like right here, but where I do bake because I like to bring the most attention to and I don't mind if it gets all dry and sets in place real, real good. And that is my nose. And I'm going to use my um, Urban Decay Powder and I actually hit pan. I can't believe that. And then I'm gonna take this Morphe Showman's Brontour and just bring some of that definition back into my face. And the nose, it's gotta be the nose. I love contouring my nose. So this is the Becca Chocolate G Ode, which is a love thing as well. I will put that in the description box. And I'm actually using my Becca brush. Now, um, lately I've been, lately I, no, I'm just kidding. But lately I've been using a smaller brush, right? If I want it to be more concentrated, but um, we're not looking for more concentration because I got a lot going on on my cheeks right now. So I just want something to give me like a flush of, um, whoa, we went in and it's okay. But I just want something to give me like a flush of highlight, right? I don't want to bring too much attention to all that I got going right there. One thing I love about foundation is when, or even if you want to do a concealer and a powder, it makes your, it just kind of brings the whole look together. It makes your eyes look like you did more than what you did. And um, it just makes it look more polished, right? More flawless. And I just love that. So when people say, can I just get eyes? I'm like, girl, what? Wait, <laughs> why? <laughs> but this is it. And I've been loving this unit. I rocked it in the last video. It's just wild. So I was like, you don't have to do much to it. And I, I love it. I love it. So I'll put that in the description box. I'll put the nails that I'm rocking in the description box and, um, uh, lipstick, not yet, baby, but I will put that in the description box very, very soon. Okay. You guys have an awesome, but less day. And I will see you sooner than you think, or maybe a little bit later. I don't know, but I love you though. Mwah! Deuces. <laughs> Confidence is key. You know what I mean. A woman feels good when she's looking pretty. Yeah.